once the train exits the tunnel heading towards Brisbane, it uh, needs to traverse down through the Toowoomba Range down to the floor of the Lockyer Valley. Uh, this is quite hilly terrain in the area and we try and follow the ridge lines as best as possible through this area. However, we can't do that the entire way and we do need to jump across some valleys. And what that means is that we have some quite large bridge or what we call viaduct structures throughout this area uh, in order to come down to the uh, floor of the, the Lockyer Valley. So these structures, uh, there's 12 of them in total down this area. Um, they range in length from about 300 metres up to 1800 metres and they, they range in height from about 20 metres up to about 50 metres. So these are uh, substantial structures. As we come down through this area, because of these large structures means that we are able to uh, allow the free movement of the local traffic network under the structures as well. The, the final bridge that we have is crossing over the Lockyer Creek um, in the Heladon Spa area. And after we cross that creek, we come down and rejoin onto the existing QR corridor uh, in the, the Heladon area. Again, trying to follow as much of existing corridor as we possibly can.